in a race guys so uh, what is going on and welcome back to Vroom Vroom Dana we are out here at the farm haven't rode out here in a while it is uh Thanksgiving weekend decided to go for a little ride we took the razors out yesterday had a good time uh, decided to take the bikes out today had some last minute plans we we're gonna go out to Ocotillo some stuff came up so we weren't able to actually head out there so uh we wanted to keep the Thanksgiving riding spirit alive and do a couple days of riding obviously you can't really film on a razor it's not that uh not that exciting to watch a lot of fun stuff when you're in it but when you're uh, recording it not not much there for you so uh today should be a lot of fun man we got gina brian my dad out here and it's been a while since we've been out here i mean a while since we've really rode, rode with uh, joey mac not too long ago was that probably two three weeks ago uh out in like the nuevo area and that was the last time i threw a leg over a bike so Still feeling a little bit rusty, man. That first hill we went up, I had some pretty massive arm pump just going up that. So uh, we're gonna come out here and do some sick trails, man. There's so much fun stuff out here. One of my favorite places to do some single track out for sure. I mean, there's pretty much an endless amount of single track for a, a day's work. Gina on a bike in years, like literally years. She's moving too. This might get a little sketchy. This might be some good footage back here. Dizzy through here. Not bad, Gina, not bad.
so he's just he's making dang pro out here. almost made me fall <laughs> that was good you're moving through there i've been doing a lot of riding during the whole uh coronavirus little shindig we got going on have you guys been riding more i've been riding less i mean i feel like it's a perfect time to ride you know you're kind of able to focus a little bit more on your hobby since everything else is uh closed down i mean you can't like at least by us go to the movies amusement parks are all closed so you're able to focus a little more on your hobbies and i mean with that we've been a lot more busy with havoc you know we've been slinging a lot more recently again people focusing on their hobbies so we haven't been able to ride as much recently and then it was 100 degrees out all summer so it kind of sucks i mean we're going to utah we're making all these trips when the whole virus first started getting our riding in going to some awesome places because nobody else was traveling and then towards the midst of it man just not a lot of riding and it's kind of upsetting i wish i i wish i was riding more because especially now i feel so rusty You're on your bike you got no traction I remember what happened last time? yeah you fell in the hole we'll go the hard way We're gonna be tired after this one. Brian hasn't ridden in like a year and he's killing it through here. <laughs> Go, Brian. <laughs> oh, my God, that was so aggressive. <laughs> Dude, that thing got a lot gnarlier. It did, Dude, it got a lot gnarlier. I think that one day we came and had about 20 people go up and down it. And then it rained a few times. It just chewed it out. Same with up here, we got some boulders. I don't remember all these being. It's hard to do that turn. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's it like kicks you now. It used to be able to go smoothly up and loop it. <laughs> I had it. Not quite, but come on, I had it under control. <laughs> Yeah, it's pretty gnarly because you got that ledge there now, too. Oh, no. Oh, 
Are you okay? Yeah. That, that one came down and almost killed you. Yeah, Brian, I got the bike. Yeah, yeah, just chill for a minute. Right, How lay you there. doing there? Lay there. Yeah, that's why I wanted you to stand there so you could catch the bike and then you did. I did, Gina. <laughs> if I would have let that bike go, it would have came full force on you. It looked cool. Yeah, I made sure not to move and you took the brunt impact of it so I got yeah, the, the footage. Yeah. <laughs> you look comfortable. Yeah, you're good. You know, honestly, I'm fine. Yeah. It landed on your helmet, luckily. Oh, no. It did. If that would have hit like your torso, that would have hurt so much more. <laughs> well, here's the thing. I'm not hurt. <laughs> I'm just shocked. Glad to be alive. Dude, that bike went full loop over. That was awesome. Uh, yeah, so like my arms are crushed, but it's fine. <laughs> you gotta let go of the bike, you know? I did. I was trying to like throw uh, it out of the way. It was all slow motion. I just like, I was like, this is not gonna end well. I thought you had it. I thought I had it too. That's why I'm shocked. You let off at the last second. Miss riding. I miss this stuff. <laughs> Watch my friends get hurt. Yeah, welcome back to the first ride. I know. <laughs> Let me fix those goggles. I, I said we were coming up to this. I'm like, fuck it. <laughs> Good job, dude. Oh. Yeah, at least you're all right. You okay? Yeah, I'm actually not hurt at all. That's amazing. Thanks to me. <laughs> Thanks to me. <laughs> Thanks to you. you know, I, I fucking like... caught the bike in the air. <laughs> That's why I was like, when you guys were all standing up there, I'm like, you know, it's been six months. I really think someone should stand right here in the event, but I had it halfway. I'm not going to try that again. That was a little scary. Alright, one more time. Jesus Christ. Thanks, Dana. What? Can you hit that coach a little bit? Yeah. You got it? I have no control over anything that happens. Yeah, Alright, we're good. He weighs like 400 pounds. It's 50-50, boys and girls. I'm gonna be honest. 50-50. Oh, I got it up! I was like, make sure it gets up! <laughs> God, how do you ride that thing? Ow. I got it up. I made sure not to make the bike tumble. Just myself. You're welcome. I got it. this thing.
that, that's pretty much a, a wrap right there, man. We're headed back to the van right now. Had some good riding today. Felt good as always to be on the bike. Still rusty. I mean, all of us are feeling the rust. That's for sure from not riding too much, but winter is probably here. Hasn't rained really for us yet. As you can tell, the dirt still sucks. There's no moisture in the ground whatsoever. So traction is definitely uh, not relevant out here at all. But I want to thank you guys so much for tuning in, man. Definitely be on the lookout for some more videos once the winter hits and that we get back into some more riding. It's just riding during the summer out here is just not fun at all. So once the rain starts hitting, man, we're going to be doing some awesome, awesome riding. So appreciate you guys so much. Subscribe if you're new. Drop a like on the video if uh, you want to see more. So thank you guys. Talk to you next time. Deuces, my friends. <laughs> I told you not to fall, Brian. <laughs> Just took me out right in the beginning.